the ancient ocean, quite possibly the most elusive of all biomes on Earth. The current oceanic climate is already mostly unknown by humans, so an ocean like that, only now buried under hundreds of layers of rock and sediment, can be very difficult to comprehend. But a few select creatures, ones like the goblin shark and coelacanth, help us to understand the prehistoric seas today. And this is because they have one thing in common, they're living fossils. Take the horseshoe crab as an example. This animal is not only not even a crab, it also has some of the simplest tactics for survival in all of the aquatic world. Whereas other animals may brutally hunt down or kill prey, the horseshoe crab finds success in simply walking along the seafloor and eating random bits of debris it finds along the ground. This creature does have one special trait though, and it's the aforementioned living fossil status. It's been around for millions of years, and because of this, a creature so simple, so bare bones, its most interesting aspect is how simple it is to flip over, can be incredibly useful for modern society. Aside from most plainly serving as food, the horseshoe crab not only helps us understand the prehistoric aquatic world, but also all life on Earth. The horseshoe crab is so incredibly simple that almost all understanding of how organisms work, humans or otherwise, derived from initial research on this particular non-crab crab. Even the horseshoe crab, an animal which finds itself so plain and typical that it hardly seems to contribute anything alone, can be utilized to benefit not just humanity, but understanding of life as a whole. And that is why the horseshoe crab is significant.